text network analysis can be used to make sense of all the different notes and ideas you write down related to a subject of your research. For example, here I have a Google Doc file with ideas about a book that I want to make with my friend. So I can copy and paste these ideas and add them into the graph. In order to do it, I create a new list and copy and paste this text there. Once I have it visualized as a graph, I have a good overview of all most influential words inside my notes and the different topics that exist in them and also how they're connected. So I can see that my book is about experiencing big things, choosing perspectives of people. I can also see the note that has all these terms inside. It's also about situations in life and how you need to act in them. So this already gives me a very good overview of what the text is about, providing me a sort of bird's eye view on the different meanings inside the text. Another interesting way to think about this graph is to look at the structural gaps between the different topics. In this case, we have a gap between experience thing and people choose. We can see there is a very useful feature here that shows a question that you can ask in relation to the discourse. This feature identifies the structural gaps between the different topics in your discourse and shows you what could be a possible new direction for thinking that would help you develop this discourse and make it more coherent. 